Welcome to the workshop. Good afternoon. Um, well, here it is. Yeah. Uh, Master Chief, the first half just got printed, just got finished printing a little while ago. Um, I've already, as you can see, started printing the uh, uh, the second half, and uh, I, I gotta say, this thing came out really nice. Uh, you guys can see that. I mean, it fits right like that. Look at that. That's gonna fit so good. Um, so I'm really, really excited about this. The thing, it, <coughs> I, there's a lot of stuff I'm gonna have to do to this. A lot of filling and stuff like that because I, I had to kind of turn down the resolution on my printer um, because this was initially a five-day print. Um, I got it cut down to two days, but. In order to do that, you gotta kind of sacrifice um, resolution, which for this isn't that big of a deal for me because I do a lot of, uh, you know, sanding and filling and, and working with it after it's printed. I just need the basic shape, and I mean, this is perfect. There's a bunch of screw ups here and stuff, but nothing I can't fix with some filler and primer and, um, and really, make it look the part. Um, so now I got I got two more days of printing uh, for the second half, um, you know, for the back half of the helmet. And uh, once that's done, uh, then I'll be able to glue the two halves together, secure them nice and tight, and then really start doing the entire, I'm, I don't think I'm gonna do much to this um, before the second half is done. Uh, I don't even think I'm going to put a coat of primer on it yet. I really just kind of want to get both pieces together and then see what I'm dealing with as a whole um, to before I do any priming and, you know, filling with that plastic wood stuff. Um, but, yeah, I, th I think it came out great. I'm excited uh, that I've been wanting to do this one since the first one, and I'm glad I waited. Uh, I think I said in the last video... Uh, I'm really glad I waited because uh, I learned a lot doing the other helmets and hoping I don't do the same mistakes I've been doing uh, on this guy here. Um, I got a little, uh, oh, I got the, um, I got the paint, um, Krylon uh, Satin Italian Olive. Um, I saw a video online of a guy that did a, a helmet, and this is the color used, and the color looked spot on. Um, it looked really good. And I think I'm also going to do a, uh, a silver underneath um, with like a technique that uses, um, you, you, you paint your silver on, and then you use toothpaste in places you're going to want to wipe off stuff um, to make it look like it's been weathered like in the corners where it's been kind of, you know, the paint's been chipped off or something. And so you put the toothpaste on in those spots and then you paint over it with your with your color, which in this case will be this uh, Italian olive. Uh, and then once it dries, then you can actually take your finger and wipe off just that section of paint and it looks like a, a chipped piece of paint came off and it shows the silver underneath it. So. Um, I'm going to give that technique a try. I don't know how good it's going to come out. Uh, I might just practice it on some other stuff, uh, just little flat pieces of plastic. But um, I, I'm excited. This this helmet, this first half came out sick. Um, oh, the other thing I'm going to do, remember my LEDs, my LED lights, the ones I used for uh, the Predator and the, uh, and the Iron Man? Well, right here, here and here, it's got two little or four floodlights, you know? So I'm gonna put the, the white lights in there with maybe a battery pack, you know, somewhere up inside the helmet. There's gonna be a lot of room in this helmet. Um, and then the only other thing I gotta do is I gotta figure out the the visor. Because the visor is very specific on this, on the Master Chief helmet. Everybody who knows what Master Chief is, it has that, I don't know, that almost gold looking, you know, mirror finish on it and, um, I haven't, I haven't really thought about how I'm going to do it or uh, where I'm going to get it or, or what, but um, I'm sure I'll come up with something. I still got some, some visor material that I made from the last one. I don't even think that's big enough. Oh, oh yeah, it is. 
Well, I don't know. Maybe that'll work. That's actually freaking sick right there. Holy cow. That looks cool just the way that is right there. That's sweet. I don't know. We'll figure it out. I'll uh, come up with some ideas and I'll keep you guys up to date with it all. But um, yeah, uh, that's it for the uh, for the first uh, or for the update on the um, on the Master Chief helmet. So uh, thanks for joining me. We'll see you next time.